Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, hi, my name is Maria. I do all kinds of videos on cleaning, organizing, motherhood, lifestyle. And today's video is gonna be a little bit different. We're gonna be doing some cleaning, some laundry, some shopping, prepping. Um, we just got back from a trip and the house is a mess. There's so much to do. Um, laundry number one is like, like this high. Um, we have nothing in the fridge, so we have to get some groceries. One of our friends had a baby and we need to get something for her as well. Basically today is a day where there is tons that needs to be done and I am actually home alone with my toddler. So we'll see how much I can get done. Obviously my lists are endless, but um, I'm gonna do the best I can and I'll just show you what we accomplished today and hopefully this will give you some motivation to get something done, something marked off your list. The first thing that I'm gonna do is throw the sheets in the wash and then I'm gonna do as many loads of laundry as I can. After coming back from the trip, there is so much to do, so much laundry. This is just something that I pulled out from the suitcase, but there's a lot more as well. And after um, I get that done, I'm going to try to make the bed before we have to go to bed. <laughs> For the sheets, I like to use some OxyClean and then some regular detergent. I'm actually using one from Costco. My husband picked it up and it's supposed to be eco-friendly, plant-based, so that's what I'm using. And this is my second load of laundry for the day. I already washed some towels, so I'll be folding those while this is in the wash. For me, I realized that when I do my laundry, I like to fold it throughout the day. So as I finish a load, I try to fold it and put it away instead of letting it pile up and then do it all at once. To me, that's really overwhelming and I just never get to it. So I figure that if I do it throughout the day between tasks, I am more likely to fold more laundry than if I were just to let it you know, pile up and then fold it all at once. And for my kitchen towels, I need to find a better solution where to store them because I keep buying new ones and then I don't want to throw away the older ones. But I feel like I'm just, you know, accumulating so much of them and this little bin can only hold so much. Once this load of laundry is washed and put away, I'm going to write down my meal plan for the week. And I started doing this about a month ago and it helps me a lot because I don't have to think about what's for dinner. I typically try to plan my meals based on what I have in my fridge and then after I inventory that, then I decide what additionally I need to buy. However, this time we just got back from a trip and we don't have much in the fridge. Finally, I'm just gonna write down my grocery list so I don't forget anything because now I have a very forgetful brain. 
and um, we're going to hit up two stores, Target and Trader Joe's. I got this boy on my mind that I can't live without, oh, his eyes are killing me. And he keeps talking about everything that he likes, and I can't stop listening. I'm thinking about him all the time, I'm thinking about him all the time, I'm thinking about him all the time, all the time. And my heart's beating fast when it's looking like that, oh, his smile is killing me. It's the way that it moves and the way that it laughs, so I can't get enough. We finally made it back from our little shopping haul and one of the main reasons why I wanted to stop by Target is to get some gifts because one of our friends had a baby and just want to give them something, you know. So I have to pack that up so it's ready to go and I don't have to worry about it. And then obviously we got some groceries which I will put away in a bit um, and then put my son down for a nap and hopefully he naps and I can get more stuff done. And because there's a lot, a lot to do today, and I'm already tired. Oh, I want him to be mine, to be mine. How to say, yeah, 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 yeah. You know, I want him now, 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 now. How to say, yeah, 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 yeah. I told him I can be a fighter if you want. I'll be there to catch you if you fall. I can make it brighter when it starts, when it starts. And now that I'm back with the groceries, I still have to clean up the kitchen area, do the dishes, empty out the dishwasher, and put all the groceries away. And you guys, I'm so forgetful lately. Even though I made a grocery list, I still forgot to buy dish soap. So that's what I'm doing here. I'm trying to see if I have any, but I don't. So um, one thing that you can do if you are in the same situation as me, you can add some water to the container that has the dish soap and it'll make it stretch a little bit longer. But Overall, I need to buy more dish soap. The funny thing is I never put flowers on my grocery list, but I ended up buying some flowers and um, I try to do it every once in a while because it just makes my day. I don't know about you guys, but just having some fresh flowers doesn't have to be expensive in the room somewhere. It just, I don't know, it makes me smile. I just, I love it. And tulips are actually one of my favorite spring flowers to have and I usually like white. I don't know. Sometimes I like yellow, but white is my favorite, and I'm just putting them in the vase because, um, I don't know, it just makes the room look nicer, 
even though there's the mess everywhere, I feel like the focal point would be the flowers. So it's kind of a way of hiding all the mess. But overall, after I did the dishes, I am going to put the groceries away. And again, I just got the essentials. Everything that I got here is for one week for us. And if I were to do a bigger grocery haul, that would make me go to three different stores. And I just don't have the time or the energy today. And when I do a whole grocery haul, I do a lot of prep work and that takes me another hour to hour and a half to cut things up, portion them and so forth. So here I just have the fruit that I'll be cutting up and washing um, and that doesn't take me that much time. And I would definitely would like to clean out my fridge because it's long overdue along with reorganizing my pantry because I haven't really kept at it and if you don't keep up with it I feel like it just goes you know out of hand and that's what happened in my case and here I'm just going to soak some strawberries with vinegar it just helps to keep them fresh longer and um, what I heard is that the vinegar helps to kill off any mold that could be possibly growing so if you ever have strawberries that get moldy then they say to soak it in vinegar and it also cleans them as well you can also throw in blueberries, any type of berry that you like. One of the berries that I don't wash beforehand are raspberries because I feel they just go bad way too fast. And here I'm actually just pouring out some oatmeal into a container and I realize that we go through oatmeal quite fast because now I actually bake with it more. I discovered that if you grind up oats, it becomes oat flour. I know it's probably no brainer for other people, but um, we didn't have a, um, like a spice grinder, but we recently got one and that's what I've been doing. And I actually really like using oat flour and baking. And now I'm just going to prep all the fruit that I have and just put it in the fridge because I prefer it to be already ready to go and washed and clean because A, if you have a kid and they're really hungry, it's a perfect snack or even for yourself. And it's just easier to have it already pre-cut, pre-washed. It just makes our lives easier. Now I'm going to throw another load of laundry and I believe it's like the fourth or the fifth load of the day.
Now that the bed is finally made, I'm just going to do some quick dusting. And I usually like to do this when I wash my sheets and make the bed, um, usually once a week. Lastly, I'm going to fold the remainder of the laundry that I didn't get to fold throughout the day and usually I like to turn on a show and watch something interesting while I fold the laundry but at this point I'm just so tired I just want to get it done. And before I go to bed, I'm just going to hang up some fresh towels in the bathroom. It's around 10 o'clock by now. I am super tired and it does take me a longer time to get all this done because I am alone with a kid and I also have to take breaks to, you know, spend some time with him, play with him, which is totally fine, but this is why it's taking me a little bit longer um, than it would typically would if I were to just do it straight without any distractions. I also picked up this really cool soap dispenser at Target and I got some hand soap as well. I'm going to fill it with that and that's pretty much it. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video and if you did, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel and I'll see you next time. Bye guys!